well be on um like uh, the south uh, east side right here but hail on the other hand receives damage from t2k and it's quite surprising that they will start this engagement earlier in miramar they didn't put up a lot of fight and uh, they they receive a lot of damage as well so t2k are standing strong here so far on this 11th slot they have to eliminate down by you 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 do alliance and that's going to be now t2k esports overall getting the domination run here so far seven elements just on the warehouse might just be able to put themselves on the mix blue squad is on rotation as well coming in from the ridges and now they want to put themselves into the mix now t2k esports on top of the hillside blue squad just right around and i think this might just be them having their backs against the wall yeah let's see if they'll be able to uh, get away from the trap a a lot of uh, nades being thrown and akul receive a nade from who tf is love and uh t2k will be joining the party right now the third party to, well in real life you don't want to be in this position but these teams want to jump in and action still ensues who the hell is love pushing in and in the process, Boom Esports. It's true, but it doesn't matter. And Boom Esports. That's going to be enough for Seven Elements to do to eliminate them from the scene. Yep, a Boom has received a Boom, a Boom, Pow from Seven Elements. But they're in the battle right now. T2K will be moving in and T2 will be going down. And Seven Element out on number six. Left with five teams. T2K still alive complete with four members and they have no will receive a lot of damage and taken down hail esports will be eliminated and that is with the help of the other teams alter ego and t2k t2k who went in for the fight left with three teams fighting alter ego though one is on the ground alba will not be getting up and it is a 2v 3v4 situation make that yep 2v 3v4 situation t2k and a great advantage good for them top three remains t2k they have 12 elimination points and they have the best odds right now of winning this clash well uh, you know gld here they don't really have a lot to things to present and uh, they haven't really proven anything at all so this is the perfect opportunity for them to change things up while alter ego once more haven't been really hurt as well and they unfortunately get taken down here by t2k one squad one player down here so far yeah, let's see if uh, they will be able to recover that one player because T2K has a great advantage overall. Manpower advantage, also complete like a number of elimination. Thus, they have a, received a lot of those loots from those loot crates. And Alter Ego has been eliminated. GLU, on the other hand, survivability from the beginning stayed quiet this time around even with zero elimination they grab a few more in a placement and they are firing back they are getting all of those uh, points that they won in this match they don't mind if they don't have that a lot of elimination as long as they can show up to the final two but how can they if 2001 will be knocked out with a grenade d2k as I would say, time to kill this round. One more elimination to go. Until then, they're going to be able to win the winner, winner, chicken dinner. What can you do? Absolutely none. And it's going to be T2K getting the most eliminations and getting the chicken dinner. Finally, after a long while of them fighting back against the enemies, they end and.